Hey guys, it's your girl Risa coming to you today. Happy Friday, everybody. What's going on? Is everybody feeling okay? Everybody in good spirits? Um, I know some of you may be getting ready for this Super Bowl weekend. I hope everybody um, be safe and enjoy yourselves with friends and family. For those of you that have to work, I hope they don't work you too hard. I hope that you're able to persevere and push through and um, get the job done uh, with diligence and all of God's strength and courage that he gives to you. I hope you're able to enjoy your day, your weekend, the moment that we're in. And I send you guys hugs, kisses, and many blessings from my family to yours, y'all. Happy Friday once again. Okay, so let's get down to this small haul. These are some things, refresher things, and some things we're going to do for this weekend. Um, we got some more Gatorade. And y'all, excuse my table. Um, it is all sorts of the paint is coming off because we're getting ready to redo it. And I'm going to put it outside. So I'm using it for right now until my other table comes. So y'all, just don't mind the table, okay? Um... We have some more Gatorade. I picked up some more Ruby Red um, grapefruit juice. What I did not get was some juices to make my punch for my husband's honey drippers. Um, so that's the one thing I know I have to go back and get. We did get some 100% apple juice. We got a few uh, drinks because they were a dollar. Just in case somebody drops by and they want some soda or something, we have some. We didn't get any two liters because we're trying to do away with so much soda. And as long as it's in the house, y'all, we're going to drink it. So I'm trying not to do too many sodas, okay? We got some of the Minute Maid Lemonade, the Fanta Pineapple, and the Fanta Orange. We picked up some more Cattleman's Barbecue Sauce. Because my husband is going to cook some ribs for this Sunday. I picked up another four pack of tuna. Because I am going to make tuna macaroni salad um, this weekend. We got some batteries. Which Corey just popped it open. He's over there in all his mess. Oh, say hey Corey. Hey. <laughs> yeah that's his spot y'all. He in there with his drawing. His everything. His bean bags. He got stuff everywhere. He already popped this open. This was ten sixty seven in Walmart, and those he used these for the controllers on the uh, video game. And I have two cans of cream chicken soup because I am going to make a chicken casserole for the Super Bowl. I picked up some cheese to add to my casserole, and this is the mild cheddar Monterey Jack cheese. And this was a dollar ninety eight for the two cup pack. And I got some Colby and Monterey Jack cheese, and the triple cheddar. Um, and all three of these was $1.98 a piece. We got some noodle cups. I went to the bread store and picked up some butter bread. We got some of the Morita. This is my favorite bread of all time. And I have three of these. These were $0.98. Cent. Um, we got some, I got some uh, cobblestone original bagels. For me to have with like a snack with some cream cheese and some fruit. And I got some hot dog buns because I am also going to make coleslaw this weekend. And these were 59 cents each. And so I have um, two of these. Over here I have a 60 count egg that I got from Walmart. And they actually was $4 and some change. And I was like, look at God how he worked. Because you guys know, I get eggs from Costco. And for seven and a half dozen, I've been paying $4.60 or sometimes $4.20 for eggs. They didn't have any. Um, they have a different type of egg that was truly expensive, so I did not get any from Costco. But I went in Walmart and I was able to get 60 dozen, um, 60 large eggs, not 60 dozen. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 60 large eggs for four dollars and some change okay yeah so score that we got a filter it's time to do some spring cleaning and um we change out our filter um try to do it every three months if we can we got some subway sandwiches um this is what we're gonna have for dinner tonight everybody else have their sandwiches and this is what we have left galen got this for this weekend now for those of you that barbecue I don't know how much the charcoal is in your area, 
Well, this is the value size. You get two bags of the 16.7 pound of the charcoal. Okay, now I went to walmart.com and typed in charcoal. They have this double pack for eight dollars and was it 94 cents? Eight dollars and 94 cents. Okay. This in the store by itself is $16.94, okay? Now, online, the regular price is $13 and some change. But they go by the size and the name brand, and the size is the 16.7 pound. So they had to price match. I don't know if you guys um, in your area, they don't price match any other store in my area anymore except for Walmart.com. So that's how I was able to get this for $8 and some change, a double pack. So y'all make sure y'all, before when you're shopping at Walmart, if they do not price match in your area, the only place that they price match is Walmart.com. So always go online and make sure you're able to either screenshot it or pull it up. They like for you to pull it up, um, whatever it is that you're going to price match. And they honor it, okay? Otherwise, they don't do it. Um... We got some cookies. They had these a dozen for five dollars from um, Subway. So we got a mixture of cookies. Um, I have a cabbage because I'm getting ready to make coleslaw. I got some creamer um, for my husband's coffee, and we got some freeze pops. We got some ribs from Rolls. Two packs of hot dogs and another pack of sausage. We go through sausage like breathing in this house. Um, we got two boxes of cereal, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, and the Fruit Loops. I got two of the um, Great Value Spaghetti, one pound. So I have two pounds of spaghetti. Um, this is going to be for my chicken casserole. We got this um, container of the Folgers Coffee, the Classic Roast, which is the only one that he likes um, from Walmart. From Rose, we got two of the potatoes once again, and these have been in my haul um, ever since I found them. And these are a dollar and some change a bag. From Walmart, we picked up some waffle fries for me to cook for Corey for dinner tonight. Is what he's going to eat. I have two whole chickens that I got from Rose for $7.56. And this is for my casserole. I got some pancake mix for breakfast tomorrow. Another gallon of milk. We needed some more coffee filters. They have already popped open the fruit roll-ups. We got Corey some pull-ups. And I think that's it, you guys. Wow. Really short. Even though I talk, I'm long-winded. Um, I do have another little haul coming up, and I'll do that in a separate video. Um, and I thank you guys for watching. I love y'all to pieces. Send y'all hugs, kisses, and many blessings. What'd you say, Corey? You said we got some soda. No, we through, boo. This the end. What you say when you say... Bye. <laughs> okay, guys, I just wanted to show you a quick clip of how I use the baskets in the refrigerator. I have one here, and I have one uh, behind there. I have one here um, that have, like, condiments and pickle, sweet pickles and things like that. And the shelf liner, as you can see, I line the shelves with it. Um, I like it because it's non-slip. There's the other basket and it has my cheese and all of that kind of stuff in it. Ooh, that bad boy heavy. But this is how I chose to do the refrigerator. I am getting another one. Um, just haven't chose the finish. I want to get some other smaller containers to put in here to house some things but I just wanted to show you really quick how I use the shelf liner from Dollar Tree and I need two more uh, rolls of that for these last two shelves and um, and the bottom of the tray so just wanted to show you guys really quick thank y'all for watching bye simple hey guys it's your girl Risa coming to you today with part two of my um my weekend shopping haul um i want to tell you that a couple of stores i went to was family dollar and 
um, Walmart, okay? Now, in Family Dollar, they have um, their wall art. Buy one, get one half off, okay? So, I purchased two pictures. I wanted them to go in my kitchen, but I think I'm going to try to incorporate them somewhere else because um, I'm going to have to figure out something. But these are the colors that I want. This blue, oh my gosh, it just, I don't know, I'm just feeling this blue. Now, if you can look at some of the things in my house, I painted this pot myself because it used to be green, but that blue is in this picture. And if you see my pillows on my sofa, just about all of these colors are in here. So, you know, whenever I see something like this, and I don't, I hadn't even paid attention to this, that it's the colors in my house. It always lets me know this is what I need to stick with, okay? So I got two of them. Instead of paying $20, I paid $15 because they will buy one, get one half off. Um, they also have it, if you spend $20 on certain items, you can get $5 off. And so today in Family Dollar, it was about the cleaning products. If you spend $20 on cleaning products, you can get $5 off. Also, I went to FamilyDollar.com and I clipped coupons. And as you can see, yes, my paper's beat up because I had it in my purse. As you can see here, they have it to where you can get the Clorox bleach, which is regular $3.75, which is the sale price. Um, you get a dollar off coupon, which will make it Two seventy-five. Okay, so that's what I got. I got two of the Clorox. I got some Glade. I did not get any of the paper towels and toilet paper because I already have some. But what I did get was the game, the game flames, and I got the sixteen count. Okay, um, regular price is I don't know what, but it says sale price four ninety-five. And you get a two dollar off coupon, so I paid two ninety five. The bad thing is they only allow you one per account. Okay, even if you use a different phone number, the people at the register are not gonna let you do it. You know, they're not gonna let you. What else I found out about Family Dollar? They do not take printable coupons. Okay, they will not take my printable coupons. I had several to use, but um, one would have given me a dollar off of my Febreze, which I couldn't get that. So, um, but I did get a total $5 off of all of my cleaning um, and laundry supplies. So, I did get the Game Flings for the $2.95. I got the Tide um, liquid detergent, which that was on sale as well. Um, I got some Comet. The Mr. Clean was not on sale. But for this big one, I had a 50 cent off coupon for, not Mr. Clean, this is Lysol. I had a 50 cent off coupon for the Mr. Clean, but it was a smaller container than this one. And it still would have made this one cheaper than the other one. So I just got the Lysol. I got picked up two of the Dawn Power Clean, and these were um, $2.50, I believe it is. Um, when I got to the register, one of the ladies was telling me that the Dawn, um, they had it in a three-pack, but it's not the... The dawn that I wanted to purchase, so I did not get that. And then they said that that dawn was on sale. As far as the tide is concerned, here it is: sale price seven ninety five. The two dollar off coupon makes it five ninety five. Okay, so I paid five ninety five for the tide. Um, what else? The snuggle was on sale for three seventy five. So I got the snuggle. And I got some paper plates, okay? So my total was um, $70 and some change, okay? And as you can see, I paid $54.40, no, $59, okay? And my change was $0.69. Cent. So that is my family dollar cleaning supply haul. So today we're going to have fish for dinner. So we stopped and we picked up some of the frozen shrimp um, from Walmart. And let me get my receipt so I can tell you how much they cost. Wait a minute. I know I'm all over the place, y'all. Hold on. 
So, wait a minute, but I'm reading the cook the um thing. Okay. So the raw shrimp was five fifty four. Okay, and I got two of those, the extra large. Um, the cream cheese was ninety two cent, and I wanted to try the great value. It was cheaper than paying two fifty eight. And then I got some butter, and I got some mayo because I'm gonna make coleslaw, and I'm gonna make um a salad for tomorrow. And then I picked up some cream cheese for my bagels that I picked up um, from the bread store. And um, that's my haul, you guys. And no, then, it's not. Right here, Corey. Tell them about this. We got the we got the flubber skinless. Some skinless what? Salmon. Salmon. Very good. And what about this? We got the bright we got the bright and early with apple juice. Okay. And how many did we get? Two. We got two. And that's it, because Mommy told him about everything else, buddy. You see? We got the Okay, game. he want to tell y'all all over again. You see? We got mm -hmm. the game speed. Okay. A tight, clean breeze. Okay. And then we got the carpet with bleach. Okay. And then we got, what is it called? Lysol. We got the Lysol, clean and fresh. <laughs> We got the breeze. Yes. We got dry with the bubbles with powder cream. Mm-hmm. We got snuggle. Mm-hmm. We got what is it called? Glade. We got glaze. Hawaii. Air freshener. We got glaze. Huh? Go ahead and read it. <laughs> what is it called? Vanilla. Vanilla passion fruit. Mm -hmm. And then we got Hawaiian breeze. Mm -hmm. We got we got family. We got plates. Okay. We got Clorox. Mm-hmm. What is Clorox? Two. You have two of them, right? We have two. This of them. is bleach. Can you say bleach? Bleach. Very well. Is that, that's everything, right? Yeah. Okay, what you say? Thank you. He's gone, y'all. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for watching. I see y'all hugs, kisses, and many blessings. Welcome new subscribers. I hope you guys are enjoying my channel. Thank y'all so much for all your love and support. All my, all my old members, y'all know I love y'all. God bless y'all. Bye, sugar. <laughs>